welcome back. It's me, Jo Prasi. I know it's been a long time since I uploaded my last video. <laughs> apa kabar? Apa kabar? Ah, I really miss you. I really miss myself. I really miss talking to myself like this. Cause it's been a while. Like it's been a while. Cause honestly, I really wanted to make videos since March. Waktu pertama kali diumumin kalau kita harus quarantine, self quarantine dan work from home. Aku pengen banget sebenarnya dari dari kemarin tuh bikin video cuma ternyata kerjaan dari kantor juga lumayan banyak. Sebulan setelah itu <laughs> dari kantor aku kayak uh, diinfoin dipotong gaji. Coba kalian ada nggak yang selama quarantine ini atau work from home? Mungkin ada yang unpaid leave ataupun uh, masih kerja tapi setengah bulan doang kerjanya dan itu eh, gajinya dipotong. Jadi aku salah satu yang masih work from home. Puji Tuhan, gak, gak sampai di unpaid leave karena aku dengar beberapa banyak teman-teman yang sampai unpaid leave. Kita juga tahu kan kemarin Airi, Airi.com itu sampai perusahaannya tutup dan teman aku ada yang kerja di situ so It's really sad. Jadi kemarin pas uh, udah dikasih tahu uh, bakal dipotong gajinya, jadi aku kayak pindah kosan karena kosan yang kemarin itu agak lumayan pricey. Jadi aku pindah kosan ke Vanya Park yang di BSD karena lebih murah di situ. Ternyata di sana tuh nggak ada wifi. I know sih, I, aku tahu pas mau pindah nggak bakal ada wifi, so I was like, okay, it's okay. Terus kemudian ternyata ada teman aku kantornya yang punya base camp gitu. Jadi aku pindahlah baru dua baru dua minggu dua minggu tiga minggu di Vanya Park itu aku akhirnya pindahlah ke Ang Angker Koka ini ke base campnya kantor teman aku. So thank you very much. <laughs> udah nampung aku di sini selama what, udah berapa se sebulan. So yeah, thank you so much. Jadi ya yeah, life has been so busy and so crazy because of this Miss Corona thing, you know, like what the fuck is happening? When will this And I just cannot wait 2020 to be over, like seriously. Oh my god. Yeah. So what do I want to talk about with you guys? Because this is like my first video that I want to upload since my hiatus. Hiatus. Asik hiatus. Selama tiga bulan self quarantine, selama tiga bulan work from home, it makes me think a lot. It makes me just focus on myself, focus on my mind, and. Ah, uh, I don't know. I'm I, I I'm not saying that I'm depressed, but selama self quarantine ini, I'm a private person. I'm an introvert, and I love being at home. But being at home for so long and no human contact for three months, three months, is just so stressful, and it. It bothers me, <laughs> and it, it somehow makes me sad all the time. It, it somehow makes me miss my friends, miss my family more than I've ever been. Then I just want to tell you maybe some some activities that you can do when you are alone by yourself, so that you don't think too much about anything, so that you don't be sad and gloomy and you know, cry suddenly at night over nothing <laughs> like I have done so many times jadi selama self quarantine ini aku mencoba untuk bikin sesuatu yang lebih produktif untuk berkarya asik berkarya bitch tadinya aku pengen lebih aktif lagi bikin video kan cuma gara-gara ada kerjaan terus kayak nggak sempet gitu juga kamera aku juga <sighs> abal-abal hey, anyway I wanna say thank you to my friend Reza for borrowing his camera to me to record this video and check out his YouTube channel kemarin gaji bulan ke bulan Mei sebelum dipotong gaji <laughs> itu aku uh, ngebeli gitar lele 
sebenarnya pengen beli gitar cuma kayak hmm, kegedean terus aku tanya ya kan sama teman aku sama si Devi Dev aku pengen beli ukulele deh e, rekomendasi dong tokonya di mana segala macam ikan yang bagus gimana berapa harganya terus si Devi kayak bang kau beli gitar lele aja ya udah deh akhirnya aku beli gitar lele dan akhir-akhir ini lagi nggak aktif banget sih cuma nyediain waktu sejam dua jam setiap hari untuk belajar kunci jadi ya aku udah udah mulai lancar lah kunci C G A D E A minor itu aja terus <laughs> aku belajar uh, G juga terus aku bela- uh, belajar dikit-dikit melodinya si um, Ocean Eyes by Billy Eilish I could show you if I am ready <laughs> cause I'm still not really good at it so ya yeah, jadi yang pertama aku adalah belajar main gitar mungkin kalian bisa belajar instrumen lain atau mungkin kalian yang dulunya itu aktif bikin uh, main instrumen kalian bisa belajar kembali untuk mengisi waktu luang kalian berasa sedih and then the obvious thing that I do during this quarantine to make myself sane is listening to music I listen to a lot of music I listen to Chromatica shout out Lady Gaga Chromatica is really good you need to listen it on Spotify iTunes and anywhere it's really good my favorite song are Sour Candy Bab- Babylon Rain On Me of course Sama a thousand deaf and 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 nine one one and Alice. Oh my God, there's a lot of pops on the album and all of the album is so cohesive and I really love each one of every song on the list. Terus album apa lagi yang aku dengar dengar? Rina, Rina Samawa. Oh my God, you need to listen to her album. It's a total bop. And one of my favorite song. on her album is I'm not a good friend like bitch that is me that song is me Terus lagunya itu aja kayaknya Oh I've recently I've been listening to a new K-pop K-pop boy band 17 and they just release a new song left and right and I think they release a new album too I'm not quite sure because I haven't listened to the new album I only listen to the left and right it's, it's a bop selain main gitar terus dengerin musik aku juga mulai kembali bikin embroidery jadi ah, jadi dulu tuh aku belajar embroidery itu pas kelas 6 SD inget banget diajarin sama ibu Josephine Sinaga Sinaga kan dia ya Sinaga pas SD di metodis 5 shout out metodis 5 sebenarnya aku pas kuliah pas lagi tugas akhir juga sempat sempat bikin embroidery pas aku lagi stres ataupun lagi waktu uh, ada waktu kosong biar aku nggak nggak mumet ini otaknya kan jadi aku bikin embroidery terus kemarin juga pas aku uh, balik ke Medan nunggu wisuda aku bikin beberapa embroidery kecil-kecil terus pas aku karantina ini juga ya kembali lagi bikin uh, embroidery dan lumayan banyak kalau kalian mau aku ngajarin kalian gimana cara bikin embroidery atau bikin tutorial ataupun bikin Masih lihat beberapa embroidery yang udah pernah aku buat Just let me know in the comment Tell me what you want to see on my youtube channel And all of that So yeah Kemudian adalah aku lakukan adalah nonton film Nonton film, film banyak banget yang aku nonton I cannot tell you one by one But the reason the movie that I watch is Kucumbu Tubuh Indahku It's really a good movie It's a movie by Uh, Garin Nugroho is a story about Wahyu Juno, Wahyu Arjuno. Di Wahyu Arjuno ini adalah uh, seorang penari lengger. Jadi kayak uh, ceritanya itu dimulai dengan si Wahyu Arjuno yang sudah dewasa 
menceritakan kehidupannya sebagai penari lengger dari kecil Bener, buka, tutup, remaja sampai dia dewasa sampai dia jadi simpanan iki gemblak sok sopo sing wani nyuwel kulit lan dagingnya aku tandingi aku lupa istilahnya pokoknya itulah uh, dia agak sedikit ngebahas tentang kehidupan si Wahyu Arjuno sebagai homoseksual nggak nggak terlalu eksplisit banget sih tapi nanti ada ada beberapa part yang expose itu sih so ya yeah. Watch that TV series yang aku pengen saranin kalian tonton selama self quarantine ini adalah Love Victor. Itu ada tuh 10 episodes. Kalian bisa nonton di Hulu ataupun di download. Ceritanya penulisnya itu sama kayak penulisnya film Love Simon. Jadi ini kayak cerita uh, coming in-nya si Victor. Jadi si Victor ini baru pindah dari Texas ke sekolah barunya ini. So where you from? Why did you move? There are girl back home. Nope, no girl back in Texas. Jadi yeah, perjalanan dia untuk menerima dirinya sendiri kalau dia itu adalah seorang homoseksual. Jadi ada intrik-intrik dari permasalahan dengan dirinya sendiri. My story is confusing. Some guys like guys, some guys like girls, some guys like both. I'm not even sure what I like. Terus ada permasalahan dengan teman-teman barunya. Terus ada permasalahan dengan keluarganya. Is everything okay between you and dad? Marriage is hard sometimes, even the really good ones. Agak lebih banyak si uh, problemnya daripada film si Love Simon itu. Cuma basically alur ceritanya agak sama. So ya, yeah, I guess that's it. Karena itu itu aja sih yang aku lakuin selama quarantine ini. Oh ya, yeah. last thing, make your own food. Wow, I just learned to make my own breakfast. I mean, it's itu cuma kayak <laughs> roti bakar sama telur aja sih. Cuma kayak wow, I can cook. I can cook something. So yeah, I guess that's it that I want to tell you about what I do during this quarantine myself. And I hope I don't bore you out like sis. You're not sleeping, right? Are you still there? Are you still watching? I don't know. I hope you do, bitch. So yeah, that's it. That was quite awkward, and I don't even know what I, where I was going about this video because this is like my first time since forever. Like, oh, uh, drama, babe. I just don't know. How to talk anymore? So yeah, I guess that's it for this video. If you like this and this video, I'm really sorry if that's really bad. I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay, I'm trying. If you like this video, please give it a like and a comment. If you want me to show you a tutorial to make an embroidery, or you want me to show you my progress on my guitar. Or you want me to recommend you some of TV series or movies that you should watch? Just comment, just comment, just comment on the comment section below, and follow my social media. On Instagram, it's at gnthnps. Jonathan PS. I guess that's it. Thank you, thank you very much for listening to all my bullshit. So yeah, see you again on the next video i really love you thank you for your support i promise i will make a better content on my video and i promise to make more in general <laughs> thank you thank you thank you see you in the next video i love you bye bye Chukai.